a man who proves that he is not dead got a chance to vote in Michigan. Dale Hopfinger finger, ran into a problem while trying to vote in Michigan. He was told that he was dead. An electoral worker even told him that the local record listed the date of his, when he died, his expiration, September 25th. After some persuasion, Hopfinger says officials finally allowed him to cast a ballot last week in Lee Township. Hopfinger tells WNEM he's been working to figure out what happened and the Social Security Administration told him it was likely a clerical error. The 48-year-old says he plans to visit the Social Security office in Bay City on Friday to try to settle the matter. Either way, he did not get a chance to vote because America, the, elector, the elector, election office, like, he's dead. But justice has prevailed and so has democracy. And now he will get a chance to vote because he's indeed not dead. He is alive! America, he's alive, he's alive, he is alive. He lives, Dale Hopfinger lives. And we're talking about him here on The Fowler Show. So Dale, this is what I want you to do for me. Now that you've received your rights to vote have been restored because you're no longer dead, I want you to take your family. Take everybody around you. Reach out and touch your neighbor, your friends, your relatives and your associates, Dale and take them with you to go vote in the next election. Maybe, Dale, you should just lead up a voter registration drive in your community because your right was almost taken away from you. So let's make sure it doesn't happen to anybody else, Dale. Let's make sure it does not happen to anybody else. Because voting America is indeed a privilege, but it's also a right. And beyond that, it is a responsibility. All right?